What's up, what's up, Mr. Hip Hop Vegan coming with another video. Hopefully everybody's doing great. And today, the topic of the day is Stephen A. Smith, the clown. The clown Stephen A. Smith. And why I'm gonna say that for. The great thing about living in America is the freedom that we have compared to different countries than most, than 99% of the countries out there. Because people are not fighting their way to leave to another country. Most people are fighting their way to come here to America. Now let's get down to what I think about people like Stephen A. Smith who is a black African American and always putting his own people down. He was upset that the Brooklyn Nets are letting Kyrie Irving play again in different cities because he's not allowed to play in New York because of the mandates and stuff like that. So he went on TV and said how disappoint, disappointed he's at, at the Brooklyn Nets. Now. I thought what made America great is that the freedom that you have. If you don't want to take the jab, you should not be having to mandate it the way they do it, because we're in America and we have the constitution and we have different rights and stuff like that. And it's sad that places like New York, places like uh, some places in um, California, Los Angeles and stuff like that, they mandate stupid stuff. Even though there's a 98% survival rate, that's neither here nor there. We're going to talk about Stephen A. Smith, the clown. He's always been doing this. He's always been downgrading his, 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 his own people. If you don't know, go look up all the stuff that he did. With Aaron Rodgers, he was different. But when it came to, to Kyrie Irving, he wants to make a whole segment talking about, oh, he's disappointed. He's dis and I'm going to tell you the truth. I didn't even watch, I didn't even watch it. I didn't even watch it because I'm just sick and tired of him coming out of his mouth on stuff that he don't know and he gets upset when people want to live their own rights. Want to live their own rights. People who want to live their own rights here in America. Kyrie Irving has the right to do, and you can have your own opinion, you can have your own whatever, whatever. There's a 98% survival rate. And to the extent that if you're healthy, most of the time if you're in shape, if you're not obese, you're gonna survive it. There's, going, there's people who are going to die anyway because it is what it is. If you want to take the vaccine, go take the vaccine. If you don't want to take the vaccine, don't take it. I think we have the right to do that because this vaccine is not the same way as a polio vaccine. Once again, this, this jab vaccine is not the same as the, the polio vaccine and other vaccines because where is polio now? Eradicated most to the, you know, is out there. You're going to get your vaccine and most likely... Your 99% chance of not catching or not getting polio. You feel me? So Stephen A. Smith coming out his mouth. And the reason why I didn't want to watch the, the segment is because I, I just know the, the junk that comes out of his mouth. I watched like 10 seconds of it. And, I, and the reason why I cut it off, because I've seen other people make videos about it. And he's, he's not getting the point across the right way. He's upset Kyrie Irving getting his money because Kyrie, Kyrie Irving stand on his own ground. Isn't that what America is for? For you to be uh, the best that you can be? You feel me? Isn't that what America was, was taught to be the best that you can be? And now he's coming. Let's say the people from the Tuskegee experiment. How do they feel? How do they family feel that they were an experiment through the whole syphilis thing and they didn't even know it? They were guinea pigs. And they treated them like guinea pigs. So how do you expect people to trust the government when they did that? When when they did that to the to the Tuskegee people? Or do, during that whole process, you feel me? Do you understand the process of what's going on? And he has the nerve to get on national television because he he just wants to talk crap out his mouth. Stephen A. Smith, the clown. That's I don't I don't even watch him no more because it, the more I hear him, the more of a clown that he is. And and the sad part is that he just shut up. People have the right to do what they want to do. And all these people saying, oh, it's not because, um, not for your safety, it's for somebody else's safety. Most people who are going to get sick and die are the people who are not healthy at all in the first place, who have different medical uh, things going on. I, I respect people's space. I respect people's 
how you say it, people's ideologies about it. If you want to get, if you want to wear a mask, wear the mask. I'm not going to fight you on that. If you want to get the vaccine, I'm not going to fight you on that either. But leave people alone. Let people live. This is the whole point about living in America, the rights that we have. We're not Cuba. We're not North Korea. We're not China. We have a voice and we can do things like that. And we're not Australia. And we're not, we're not soft ass Canada either. Canada has the nerve to, you know, soft ass Canada where they just soft. And I said it right here on camera. <laughs> it, it just, it's, it's crazy, man. We're not, we, we're not a, a, a communist country. We're not a socialist country where um, things like that can happen. You know, we're, we're a capitalist country. And if you believe it or not believe it, the best place to be in America, the best type of, 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 um, the best type of way to be in America. <laughs> who, who doesn't want to live here? And then you got people, clowns like Stephen A. Smith, who all, all they want to do is put people down and, and, and don't even study and don't even find the doctors who saying, you're not going to die. Like I said, 98% survival rate. It might be even more a percent down, a percent up, but at the end of the day, Kyrie Irving has the right. Do I disagree a lot with what Kyrie Irving does? But hey, he's in America. In the same way Stephen A. Smith has the right to say what he want to say, but I just, you get tired of some a clown like Stephen A. Smith, or all he does is clown all day and be a clown about stuff that, thinking that because he's on national television, he could just, oh, get the, get the vaccine. Oh, one guy I know, he said, oh, the reason why he survived because he got the vaccine, but he eats like shit. You, he, I'm not even going to, I'm not even going to go there. I'm not even going to put that person's name out there because it's, it, it's a waste of time. They, they do what they want to do. But let's stop with this this foolishness. America was was made to be somewhat free as we are, and to the most part, we're the best place to live at is here in America, and and we have rights more than most people. So Stephen A. Smith is a clown. That's all I got to say. Peace.